Texas confession. I've never seen snow in real life. I posted this and it snowed like two inches a week later for the first time in like 35 years. What the fuck? Texas confession. I've never had a million dollars. But up deep to cut the dough. Up it very long time ago. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cotton I do. Yeah, anybody here named Jeff? Yes. Yes. Fuck this post. People today with access to more raw information than any other period. The earth is flat. German artilleryman in 1916 who barely washes his own ass. I need to account for the curvature and rotation of the earth when plotting mine firing plans. Eratosthenes, an Egyptian, in 3750 BC when fucking mammoths hadn't even gone extinct yet. Oh hey, I can use these two obelisks to calculate the earth's entire circumference based on the length of their shadows and the earth's curvature. Neat. Each dot represents 5,000 hogs. World Geography, 1948. Untapped infinite hog supply in the ocean. Each state is lined with an impenetrable wall of swine. We are trapped. We've lost Canada and Mexico to the hogs already. Garden hints. Buy vegetables at the store. Hide them in the garden like Easter eggs and claim they grew there. The Daily Times, New Philadelphia, Ohio, April 23rd, 1924. The same newspaper, April 7th, 1924. Garden hints! Throw your empty tomato cans in the garden to let the tomato plants know you're getting impatient. 1920s shitposting. Why is there a coyote on a bus? Because they can't drive! Let's not forget that my brother had a teenager photo shoot when he turned 13. Oh. My. Fuck. This is one of those things you do as a parent because you're an asshole and know that your kid doesn't know any better and you know that, like, fine wine, this is only gonna get funnier with age. Like a great big bottle of uncorked shame. Cause, I mean, that is just not a safe place to play the guitar. One in 20 people has been the victim of a crime, which means that 19 out of 20 people are criminals. How Tumblr thinks statistics works. Jack Black is literally the only human that never needs any context for me. I could see him going anywhere and doing anything. Like if I got abducted by aliens and saw him just wandering around the spaceship putting bugle chips on his fingers to make it look like he has claws, I would be like, that's some classic Jack Black right there and not even question it. If you don't kiss her cat on their tiny soft little forehead, what the fuck are you even doing? Yelling at her for trying to eat plastic. Okay, Tom Holland is cute and all, but he constantly looks like he's hiding a frog in his mouth and it's uncomfortably hopping around in there, but he can't open his mouth or the frog's gonna escape. <laughs> to remember how many feet there are in a mile, you just gotta use five tomatoes. Five two mate o's sounds like five two eight o, oh, and there's five thousand two hundred and eighty feet in a mile. To remember how many meters there are in a kilometer, you just remember one thousand, because the system of measurement in the rest of the world wasn't invented by a drunk mathematician rolling dice. From a principal's publication, 1815. Students today depend on paper too much. They don't know how to write on a slate without getting chalk dust all over themselves. They can't clean a slate properly. What will they do when they run out of paper? Proof that someone has bitched and will bitch about young people's technology throughout all of time and space. These damn kids and their tablets. Yeah. Are you ever in the middle of saying something or showing someone something and you realize that literally no one cares? I never understood the thigh gap thing. Everyone has a thigh gap if your fucking stance is wide enough. But they're talking about a thigh gap when your legs are together. The fuck? Who would want to date someone who isn't in a power stance all the time? Go. 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 Ho ho! Someone else makes a mistake. Hey, don't worry, buddy. It's not a big deal. We can fix this. We'll figure it out. I make a mistake. I'm irredeemable worthless garbage and I want to die. Meet the rat who's paid minimum wage to chew holes in Kanye's $3,000 t-shirts. Peak capitalism is not immediately knowing if this is satire. Next time a conspiracy theorist tries to tell you what really happened, present a more outlandish theory and accuse them of covering up the truth. The moon landing was faked. <laughs> you believe in the moon? 
there were no cases of autism before 1930. Yeah, Mount Everest wasn't discovered till 1856, but I'm sure the fucking mountain still existed. After a long day of work, I accidentally greeted someone with my reflex customer service. Hey, how can I help you? And without missing a beat, he accidentally said, hey, what can I get you? He works at Starbucks, and that was the closest I've ever felt to someone. We were two NPCs who met in real life. So I walked into the dentist this morning. My dentist asked me how my weekend was. I said, good, I watched Captain America last night. I really liked it. And my dentist says, oh, my son is in that movie. At first I thought he was joking, but then I realized, Dr. Robert Evans. I looked it up. My dentist is Captain America's dad. Chris Evans was born in Massachusetts and raised in the town of Sudbury. And his father, Robert Bob Evans III, is a dentist. I like how he said he's in the movie as if he's an extra and not the main character and also Chris fucking Evans. Imagine if trees gave off Wi-Fi signals. We'd be planting so many trees and we'd probably save the planet too. Too bad they only produce the oxygen we breathe. Also, like 10 to 15 years from now, I hope someone makes one of those inspirational sports movies, except it's a 50 year old woman who wants to play competitive online games and everyone tells her she can't because she's too old. Her reflexes are too slow etc. And she gets this grizzled trainer. Except they're a 19 year old kid who had a promising career until carpal tunnel syndrome ruined their chances of becoming the world champion. So they train her and she fucking wins the end movie of the year. Your dog needs meat and your kids need vaccines. End of discussion. Also, your dog needs vaccines and your kids need meat. Also, your meat needs vaccines and your kids need dogs. What? These are all true. Every computer needs a cleaning keyboard mode where the keys would be inactive while you wipe them down. Why not just clean it while the computer is shut down? While the computer is what now? Barack Obama, Michelle Obama's husband. Ah, okay, that guy. Found in a physics textbook. You are kidnapped by political science majors who are upset because you told them political science is not a real science. Although blindfolded, you can tell the speed of their car. Uh, physics majors throw a lot of shade, considering they're still not sure where 95% of the universe is hidden. My brother's a graduated theoretical physicist. Only response to this was, well, neither does anyone else. Hmm. 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 Why isn't it evolving? She already legendary. Oh, yeah. So a mystery student just emailed my entire class a free PDF version of our textbook and left probably the best email I've ever seen. Yo, what up, classmates? This is your boy, Gary Oak. Here's the textbook for free. Smell you later. My brain. Eat. Okay, what should we make? No make. Only eat. Me, when I buy 24 Roombas and an Amazon Alexa. Alexa! Unleash the Roombas. 24 Roombas emerge slowly from under my bed, consuming everything in their path. <laughs> Fun Christmas idea. Hang mistletoe, but instead of kissing, you have to fight whoever else is under it. Missile foe. Someone's halls are getting dead. I'm tired of you fake Ratatouille fans thinking the rat's name is Ratatouille. For the last time, his name isn't Ratatouille, it's Ratatouille's monster. Cooking show I desperately want. Professional chefs compete to wow and astound totally amateur food critics who don't know dick about shit. Get eliminated on totally arbitrary grounds such as I don't like sour cream. It's creme fraiche. Whatever it is, I don't like it. The Big Bang Theory. Audio mistake. Audience laughter can be heard repeatedly throughout the episode, despite the absence of any actual jokes. Swear words are illegal now. If you say one, you'll be fined. Heck, you're on thin fucking ice. <gasps> oh no. Have you ever really thought about how when you look at the moon, it's the same moon Shakespeare and Marie Antoinette and Van Gogh and Cleopatra looked at? They all looked at the moon. They're all dead. The moon is killing people. Wake up, America! When my dad was in college, he had a friend who told a girl he'd take her on a date unlike any other she'd ever been on. And so he took her to the supermarket to watch the lobsters fighting in the lobster tank. They're married now. November is like the Thursday of the year. I don't know why this makes so much sense, but it does. Boys who can pull off facial hair are hot. I think you're supposed to use a razor. 1960 with a high school diploma. 
Here's your job, which is totally capable of supporting a five-person family and owning a home. 1960 with a college degree. Here's a giant bag of money and a cater of people to jerk you off for the rest of your life. Congratulations! 2017 with two bachelor's degrees, a master's, a trade, and experience. You might have to just work at Walmart for a while. At least you don't live in Somalia or something. Here's an article by a baby boomer about why your generation is lazy. It would funny if it didn't hurt inside. You've heard of Panic at the Disco. Now get ready for Yikes in the Yard. What a beautiful wedding. What a beautiful wedding set a bridesmaid to a oh, waiter. Oh yes, but what a shame. What a shame the poor groom's bride is a whore. She's a whore. Patreon tonight. I'm gonna list my fans till the morning light. A Patreon tonight. I'm gonna look at some casual fans. Be my casual fae. And coming up around the corner are these super fans. Win win for the win, Alex Healy, Small Cat, Eggplant Production, Shane, Cinderon, Domosaurus Rex, coming around, Michelle Adu, Emily Flahai, Will Durney, Marcus Rodledge, Medic Red, Max Hossman, Spooky Dolset, Johan Brockstedt, coming up behind Anna Davis, North up here, Michael James, Matt Jackert, Mon Operator being a pain in my ass, coming around, Scarlet, Sir Bodacious, there, Hunter Peter Yost, Luke Held, Connor Allen McKee, Fierce Daily Links, coming up behind Parker L. Reed, Sam Bars, Ebony's I.O., Figgy Boy, Luke Bob Mabel, Norg Norg Sand, Becca Moreno, and Coming up behind it, JWD Legends, Mr. Moses, KZ. I was one year from retirement. There was nothing I could do but think back on all the partners I'd lost throughout the years. It was Garrett Saunders, Ivan, Akash Balai, oh god, Akash, what happened? Christian Yates, I can see the Ox King now. Oh, Tiffany Carey, no. Wanderu. Duncan Skinner, why so soon, Duncan Skinner? Megalodon, oh, he was corrupt. There was Larkin, Amir Jawad. Oh, how could I forget Chloe Schlenk? She still troubles me to this day. Shut up and take my money. Head pets, Jake Thompson, Sean Joseph, Nolan Patterson. I'll never forget Ryan Hill or Ayrton Salenti, no. You know, there were the good cops like Jesse Detrone. Fluid McGree, Joseph Hill, even screw you, Mr. Moats. He was great. And Lazarus and Wissam Shafi, Tyler Bunnell, and Miles McMahon. Why Miles McMahon? Fable. Oh, God. Hunt <laughs> Spencer Torres. Hey, everybody. I think it's time we put the fun back in. Doug. Ethan Johnson, Dual Nature. Donald J. Mumps, Satan, Chris Hendry, Sneak Shadow, Professor Pole, August S. Freitag. Everybody wants to be somebody, but someday you'll need somebody. Just remember when your back's against the wall Just remember you can always call Everybody wants to be somebody But someday you'll need somebody